Okay, this Koromaru. Um, bridge. Go to space. Chill in the bridge. Chill. Form. Okay. To remember to give it to Elizabeth tomorrow or later. Okay. I will try to remember that. And then. Okay, he isn't available, so we will do Cormar. Bark. Wait a minute, this. This will give stuff for people, so yes. Hopefully. Uh, why him? Getting so excited. Don't you go on walks all the time? Anybody else would have been better because I don't need friendship stuff with him. But whatever. Whatever. Go on and run all you want. Don't steal my words. I don't like the way things are looking out there. Feels like a storm's coming. Well, whatever happens, happens. I mean, don't get me wrong, he's okay, he seems like a cool dude. But this is, feels like this happens when people join the group late. Is at this point I've already got other people to worry about or care about, and he just kind of showed up. Like, I have no reason to care for him. He's just there. What? You done already? This place was your home, right? Of course, you know, Koromaru is different. Koromaru is Koromaru. He's a good boy. I care about him way more. Hmm? What you got there? Amethyst. Doesn't look like anything dangerous. Why don't you hang on to it? It's... You know what an amethyst is, right? It's a gem. It's worth a decent chunk of money. Come on. Let's head back. Just real. Something. It doesn't happen. Hang on a second. Is this like just barely? Hang on. I thought that was just barely not filling in there where you could kind of see it like the edge. I think that might be a bit better there. Can you hear people talking? Of course, I heard there's a nasty typhoon on the way. You think we'll still have the cultural festival Saturday? Yeah. <coughs> Saturday? Jeez. Nah. I don't think so. The way they're talking, the typhoon's gonna be way too destructive. You seriously think it's gonna be cancelled? Man, after all the work we put into preparing for it. Okay, so it might be cancelled. <clears throat> Classes have ended. So double check. Hey there. Come back on. I'll come with you. Let's go. Feels closer. We won't go closer. Okay. So stuck there for a little bit. I'll have to waste time with that. I was going to hang out with Uka. But that's no longer an option. So I guess we'll... I wish I could just give gifts. Like... I thought that would be so much easier. Hey Alright, so I'll come. I won't go any closer. Yeah, yeah let's get, go somewhere. Like... Like here, just give a gift here. Is there like a special button to press? Doesn't. Oops. 
that's not it. Well, it's dark. Let's start head back to north. Hmm. What's up? It's always him now. Bridge should be chill by now. Yeah. And what we got over here? Albert's Koromara's hair, it seems like. Fur. Fur, I should call it that. Alright. Chill, Takayaki. Let's go turn this in. Also, let's go check. See if that guy has more URLs. So this is the chilled takoyaki. Well, it certainly is cold. And has a soft, chewy texture. It cu such cute, round eyes. What? Shall I savor every bite? What are you eating? Please take this as your reward. Nail cloth? Um, bring a drink or food you made together with someone at the dorm. I have plenty of these. Someone called home cooking meal. Home cooked meals with, which possess a special kind of flavor, exist in this world. In your world, please. I'm curious what it tastes like. Very much so. Could you bring me some with the flavor of this home cooked meal? I can be either food or beverage. I ha I have no preference. Well then, I look forward to it. Um, I have them though. Very well. Yeah. Wait, what? I've been waiting for you. Oh, it appears you have what I believe to be home cooked meals. What would you like to give me? Oh. Chicken saute. Oh, my. oh, I believe this is the first time I've ever heard this. Had this. Yet yeah, this flavor tastes rather nostalgic. I see. So this is what a home cooked meal is. I believe I now understand what, why people crave the taste of home cooking. Thank you very much for sharing this culinary delight. Please take this as your reward. Legendary cleaver, huh? Do you need anything else? Um, any new requests? Steer's potato? Oh, I have grown this. By the way, I heard a rumor that a potato grown with painstaking love and care will develop in mysterious power. I believe you can obtain the proper seeds to grow such plants in the shop that deals with plants. Would you please grow and nurture a potato to verify the authenticity of these claims? Um, hand over potato. Oh, yes. I sense an unusual power emanating from you. Do you perhaps have one of the potatoes you have grown? The touch or potato? What a truly bizarre potato. I can sense a unusual power radiating from it. I imagine it would make a rather appealing meal. Hmm? Why are you giving me such a strange look? In any case, the request is now complete. Please take this as your reward. Here we go. Tight shard, okay. Anything else along that part? Okay. Finish that. Uh one. Quite a bit. Which reminded me, I haven't checked this in a bit. I think I already checked this after I got back. I believe I already have this. And this. Mm-hmm. Okay, if this was a stronger weapon, that would be really good. what will it be? So what will it be? I already have that. So what will it be? Um those these could be useful. 
Depends on the boss we fight. Everything good. So it's always good to, I guess, come back here when I know what the boss does. If it does status effects, like the charm and all that stuff. But not too worried about that. You. Okay, there is stuff. Buy. And buy. Okay. And that I need to remember to do. This. We already bought that. Which is kind of funny. Don't really need it anymore. Well, it seems like a waste of 200,000. This could be really good, though. And I guess this is where I get these if I need them. No. Doesn't do anything. That's the point. So I might save it for that. We'll see. Okay, let's go back to the dorm. And honestly... We'll check. Like, does this give you anything? Anticipation. Uh, I feel like I need to do these because these gave me something that I needed. Taking down enemies. Start up a buzz. I'm curious about this. URL leads. Effective security measures online. There's a website. Security team. Mental explaining explanation. I guess I'll start the most watched video. What does this do? I have a video on subduing violent individuals. I learned the importance of having the will to stand up to the enemy. Maybe I can use what I learned in our fights in Tartarus. You learn how to ambush. Okay. You can now ambush enemies while exploring. When ambushing an enemy, you will trigger chance encounter regardless of the direction an enemy is facing. Press and hold R2. Look at the dash. Set distance to encounter. Assault stance. By person square while in assault stance, you will ambush an enemy. Triggering an encounter from behind will slightly increase the energy gauge and may distress the enemy. Ooh. Okay. That could be helpful. Can you hear talking? Jeez, they're just really talking about this, huh? Hey, did you hear about the, uh, did you go to the film festival during summer vacation? Oh, never mind. This is something different. Oh, the one at Port Island Movie Theater? Yeah, I watched a bunch of things. I heard they're gonna have it again next week for just one day. You wanna go? On the 23rd, right? I'll pass on this one. Forgot that the theme of this was... But I remember it was all kitty. Looks like this is me on... Okay. Go with me, maybe? I think I hung out with everybody. Wait, what was it? What? what? Shed back the dorm, something's ominous? Excuse me? Hi. This is the first time we've met during the day. And you're just still walking around with a gun? And nobody stopped you? Let's have a chat while the opportunity presents itself. Not only does he not have a shirt on, so he could should have been arrested for indecent exposure. Um, but the fact that he's carrying around a piece on him in broad daylight. Excuse me? What about the typhoon? 
That doesn't concern me. Now, let's be off. Nothing concerns you. You have a god complex. Understand one of my group has caused you some trouble. Is she in good health? It must be difficult looking after her. After all, you likely can't rein her in for very long. She's doing fine. Could it be you've already killed her? <laughs> um she's fine for now. We don't kill people. So you're keeping her alive. Then I take it you've had to use the suppressants, as I'd expect from Kirijo's resourcefulness. And you now have someone with first-hand experience among your number as well. Kirijo hasn't really done much about it. It's all been the new member. If you already know about the suppressants, that simplifies things. Can you imagine it? A Persona user murdered by their other half. Such is the fate of a Persona that has gone berserk. Sounds like Persona 4. As you have already seen for yourself. This power of ours is not meant to be wielded by just anyone. That holds true even for those who were awakened by force. It comes at a great cost, and we can only harness it by walking the line between life and death. This power makes us who we are. And yet, you hold the ability to wield so many. The Dark Hour has graced you with its favor, almost unjustly so from our perspective. Now, I ask you, no. would you think it'd be a shame for you to lose such a special power? I, I can literally answer, answer no to any question he ever asks, and I will be right. Um, it's for the sake of the world, it's for my friends? It's for everyone. This feels like all high and mighty, and this just... Alright, you know, I'm gonna be the protagonist. It's for my friends. You stubbornly cling to that sentiment. Do you have no intention of understanding anything? Choosing to turn a blind eye towards your own power, to the grief of the fallen, the unchosen, the unloved. You would hear yourself right now. <laughs> such apathy, such insolence. You trample upon everything we stand for. And worst of all, your rejection of my... Hmm. You tread upon your gifts like dirt, and in doing so, reveal your own arrogance. It disgusts me. I see now that nothing change your mind if our beliefs are at odds with each other and neither side is willing to concede then a battle is unavoidable yeah you, you should go you know prove yourself by go fighting the typhoon you know stand on the roof with like a parachute on see what happens i'm sure you could win y your gun will really help you with that let me know how it went Final confrontation will come in our own time. All right, you know, don't trip and cheat yourself. You have been blessed with a power greater than any other, and yet you don't see its true value. Yeah, yeah, just go. Such a shame. Come on, go walk into the wall over there because there's no exit. I'm drenched in the rain. Jeez, he's such a rude guy. Old body is shivering. Seriously? Am I gonna lose a bunch of time because I'm sick? I think this has already happened. Huh. Didn't quite make it, huh? According to the news, a typhoon just hit. Apparently, it's the biggest one on record. It's moving slowly too, so it'll be gloomy for a while. I, I didn't check the calendar, but I guess there wasn't much time. 
anyway before the cultural festival or whatever. But whatever. Yeah, thanks to that, the school festival got canned. And then I don't know what the game is trying to do with the whole talking to that dude. Like, he's complete psychopath. So talking to him is basically a big waste of time. Because you aren't going to understand him. And he isn't going to make me decide to help him. Or care about him in any sort of way. So it's like, he's just wasting my time. Trying to, you know, talk about his... It, it's, it's a weird thing they're doing with this game, and so far, not liking it. Just wasting my time. Well, less work for us in the end, I guess. Still sucks that we'll be stuck indoors for vacation, though. So, what you gonna do over break? Be stuck indoors? Um, I made plans. No, I didn't. Nothing special, probably. Forgot we had one. Seriously? Dude, you're killing me here. What about you, Fuka? Me? The only thing I plan to do is go to the movies. Why Fuka? Ooh, a movie? Do you have a date? It, it's not like that. I'm going with Natsuki-chan. We actually talk about movies all the time. Isn't we are we in the middle of a big storm? There's not gonna be any movies. But with this typhoon, I don't know if we'll make it. How about you, Yukatan? Still gonna have practice? Hmm? I don't know. The archery range is outside, so it's most likely cancelled until the storm blows over. Same here. This stupid typhoon is gonna mess up my training. You gotta be but right, Kurijo Senpai? I'm not sure yet. Why are you so curious about our business, Iori? Oh, me? Well, I'd be happy to tell you about my plans. Okay. At first I was like, is Shidori asking him about us? But no, he's just wanting someone to ask, what are you going to do? So he could brag about, you know, hang out with Chidori. I suspect that you will be visiting Chidori-san. Although she is in stable condition now, we still can't release her. Man, I John, you must be psychic. And you know what? She even told me she wants me to come. Oh man, I can't believe she said that. So I figured I should probably check up on her. You know, with the storm and all. Mm-hmm. What's with him? Is he all excited? Um, well... Mm-hmm. I don't know either, huh? Um... Oh, Amada-kun! What are your plans during the break? So yeah, I think maybe Fuka's not savvy enough to know, but I think she just does know and just doesn't want to say. And Akihiko's never going to figure it out. Oh, I'm not really doing anything in particular. Come on, you gotta be doing something. Oh, I'll probably go visit the shrine. Dude, you're a kid, not an old man. I always go to pray, though. I guess you could say, I have a wish I want granted. <sighs> anyway, I'm going back to my room. I've got a lot of homework to do. Oh, okay. Just holler if you get stuck, yeah? Mm-hmm. <sighs> <sighs> Feel better on the weather, maybe I should have extra red or a little.